Hello friends, I'm Parwait and this is our 34th video in PyQt5 GUI programming with Python 3. Uh, in the last video we have covered how you can connect uh, your PyQt5 application to MySQL database. Uh, this is from the previous video uh, that we now you can see that successfully connected to database. If you haven't watched the previous video, I highly recommend you to watch the previous video. Uh, today I, uh, we are going to cover how you can insert data uh, to MySQL database uh, through your PyQt5 application. For this I am going to make a new Python file. I call it insert data like this. Uh, after that I am going I have opened my web server. Uh, in the previous video we have made PyQt5 database and today I am going to add tables in my disk. Uh, database. Uh, I want to add uh, name my uh, table to data and I add the number of columns to 4. Okay, we need the first thing we need an ID, after that we need a name, we need a email, and also we need a phone. Okay. The ID should be integer and it should be auto increment like this and the name should be a uh, voucher 255 uh, the email it should be voucher 255 and the phone should be end and also 255 okay now I am going to insert this okay now we have a uh, a table, ID, name, email, and phone. Right now, there is no data in my table. Okay. After that, I'm going to uh, add my window code. Uh, let me check this. Yeah, my window. I copy this and I add this in here. I change the title to PyQt5 Insert Data. Like this. Uh, for this, after that, we need some imports. Let me run this. Uh, sorry, let me run this. You can see that now I have a nice table. After that, I'm going to import some in here, some imports. Uh, the first one is we need a Q line edit, we need a Q push button, also, we need a Q message box. And uh, we are going to import uh, MySQL DB as MDB. If you haven't watched the previous video, you should watch because I have covered uh, completely this uh, MySQL DB in that video. After that, I am going to define three line edit in here. Self dot line edit one. Line edit one. Q line edit. I'm going to give a placeholder for my line edit. Dot set placeholder text. Uh, please enter your name. And I'm going to set uh, geometry for my line edit. Set geometry. And I give this to 200, 100, and uh, uh, 200 by 30. If I run this, you can see that now I have a nice line edit with please enter your name. I'm going to copy this because I need two more of them. It should be line edit 2. Please enter your uh, email. And I change this to 150. Let me copy this line edit 3. Please enter your phone. It should be 200, the geometry. Okay. Now, if I run this, now you can see we have three nice line edits with nice placeholders. After that, I'm going to uh, add a push button. Self dot button Q push button insert 
data and uh, it should be self after that I'm going to set geometry for my button the geometry should be uh, 200 by 250 and uh, 200 200 250 uh, 200 no 100 and um, it should be 50 it should be good if you run this yeah now you can see we have insert data after that I'm going to define a method in here def insert data for defining uh, my query I'm making a con ob connection object dot connect okay we need some arguments in here parameters it should be localhost uh, the user name is root I don't have any password and my database name is pyqt5 wetcon I'm going to make a cursor uh, con dot cursor after that I'm going to execute my query execute and uh, insert into uh, my table name is data okay it has let me check this one again I should check the structure we have name email and phone name email phone and the values and the values I give uh, we need placeholder for this mm, like this sorry it is not like this let me copy this uh, because we have three value in here okay after that I'm going to join this uh, dot join <coughs> self dot line edit one dot text I am uh, mm, uh, getting the data data from the user yes, it was first line edit value uh, the join cell dot line edit line edit two dot text dot join cell dot line edit three dot text okay like this after that I'm going to uh, make a message box dot about self uh, connection data inserted successfully and after that I'm going to close my application okay now the this the insert data code is completed after that I'm going to uh, connect my button cell dot button dot clicked dot connect cell dot insert data okay uh, let me run, run this hopefully it should be okay okay now I'm going to add some values in here enter your email I give it a email address like this and I give a random phone number if I click on insert data I am receiving uh, an error. Let me check this. Where is the error? And let me check in here. I have a data voucher voucher end end. It is auto increment. 
um, dot cursor cur dot execute insert into data name email phone yeah in here I think and this should be like this okay let me run this I give an email address and I give a number now if I insert data you can see data inserted successfully if I check my database table you can see that now I have uh, one uh, value in here let me run this again I want to add another uh, John John at gmail.com and I give a phone number like this insert data data inserted successfully and if I check this my web server you can see that now I have John John at gmail.com uh, this is the complete code if you have any question please let me know and uh, for the further videos don't forget to subscribe my channel